I just decided to pick up the camera and film a little bit today because I was finally uh, putting some decorations on our Christmas tree. We have had the Christmas tree put up in our living room for like two weeks with absolutely nothing on it. Um, and so I figured today um, was a good time to go ahead and decorate that. So I hope you enjoyed seeing how it turned out. But all of my kids have Christmas trees um, that they have in their bedrooms. So they have had those decorated for a long time and they did a really good job on them. Um, and so they didn't feel the need to help me with our big tree, which was fine with me um, because I like to do it the way I like. Does that make me a horrible person? I hope not. Um, but yeah, they got to help decorate their own trees. So anyway, um, we have I have one last Thanksgiving celebration that we are going to tonight with a couple of friends, just a really small group. Um, and so I just got all ready. I look way better than I looked in those last clips because I just took a shower, fixed my hair, put on some makeup, and I'm wearing my, excuse this trash bag, but I'm wearing my turkey shirt that says gobble gobble and I love it so much I've got my fall leaf earrings on and I'm just feeling like Thanksgiving um and so I'm really excited about that you guys watch me make deviled eggs which um I'm not the best at but I hope they turn out good um I keep noticing this dirt on my cabinet that's a little better 
Um, but yeah, I made deviled eggs for tonight. I'm also, let's see down here, I've got two pans of dressing cooking in the oven. And then I also made this apple dump cake, which smells really good. Um, and then we'll have ice cream to go with that. So those are my contributions <laughs> to the meal tonight. But anyway, I haven't actually like said words to this vlog yet. So I wanted to just say hello. Um, let you know that I am grateful for you watching this video and I have had an overwhelming response from my last video of people saying yes please do your Christmas videos um, and so I am planning to film those really soon um, I usually have to wait until after Black Friday to film my Christmas videos because that is when I tend to do the last bit of my shopping and so that finally just passed I got a few things online this year um, I did pop into Walmart just during the day on Black Friday um, and got a couple things but um, yeah I am pretty much done with my shopping so I should be filming those videos for you guys really soon which is very exciting they're my favorites to film of the whole year um, anyway <laughs> I don't know what else I'm going to add into this video. This may be it, but maybe not. Who knows? But we'll see. And again, thanks for watching and let me know. Have you got your trees up yet? There's my boy. This is Fisher. Can you say hi? Hi. Hi, friends. We're talking to our friends. Are you our friends? Yeah. You want to show them our Christmas tree? Yes. Yeah. What do you think? Where's our tree? Uh, Where's our Christmas tree? It's right here. <gasps> Is it beautiful? Yeah. Yeah? I gotta look at my boots. Where's your, oh, those are mommy's boots. Those look cool. I got Diet Coke. Yeah, you took my Diet Coke. Better give it back. <laughs> what? <laughs> anyway. I will see you guys in a little bit. Hey friends, so I am in the same spot, but it is a few days later. Um, I haven't really known what else to film for this video, so I've just kind of left it, but I wanna, gosh, what is this? I want to finish this video and get it posted um, before I start filming my Christmas videos, um, my Christmas gift videos. The problem is I have been wanting to get one more gift for Fisher, my four-year-old, um, and I haven't done that yet, but I'm hoping to do it today. Like, I feel like my two older kids both have a really good, like, main big gift that they're getting this year, and I have struggled so much with knowing what to get Fisher um as his big gift like I, I've he's easy because he's happy with anything like any little toy anything he's totally happy but just as a mom I feel kind of bad with my big kids getting something really cool and awesome and amazing and then not having him anything that's kind of a big gift so I've been racking my brain trying to come up with something that would be that wouldn't just be a waste of money and that he would actually use and love. Um, anyway, I think I figured out an idea. I'm hoping they're not sold out. Um, but if they're not, I think we're going to go get that today. And then hopefully also I can start wrapping some Christmas presents, which I'm so excited about. Oh, side story. Um, I don't think I've mentioned this in a video yet, but on Thanksgiving, Thanksgiving morning, we went outside. Um, my husband was gonna go get donuts for the kids that morning. Um, went outside and my car had been stolen. <laughs> um, my car had been stolen out of our driveway in the middle of the night, the night before Thanksgiving. So we have been dealing with that. Um, it has been a whole ordeal. Um, the police, we called the police, um, they looked for our car, and about um, five days later, they found it. It had been abandoned in some other town, um, and it had been wrecked, 
Um, they said it looked like maybe they tried to drive it through a gate or try to like use it to break through a gate or something. Um, I'll insert a picture of what it looks like here. So we still haven't seen the car in person yet since it got stolen, um, but the person at the towing company um, sent me the, that picture um, of what it looks like. So we are waiting to hear from our insurance to find out if it's totaled or if they're going to fix it um, or if we get a new car or what. So we're waiting to hear from that. Um, but yeah, our, we have a doorbell camera. It didn't pick up anything. You can't really see our driveway from it, just kind of our front door. So um, it didn't pick up anything. My car was locked in the driveway. Um, my keys were in the house. My purse was in the house. And my husband, Jeff, is notorious for always, always, always locking his truck. Um, but he had gotten back that night and he had all the kids and they had a ton of stuff that he was helping carry in. He was carrying our four-year-old and he said that he was planning to go back out and lock the truck after he put all the stuff down and forgot. So the one time that he forgot to lock his truck, um, of course, they come and found a spare key to my car in his truck and took it. So yay. <laughs> Thanksgiving was definitely a different one for us this year. So anyway, um, I brought all of that up just to say I had bought all my new rolls of Christmas wrapping paper <laughs> and they were in the back of my car that got taken. So it's funny because I feel like I'm more upset that I lost my Christmas wrapping paper than I am about the car um, because I was so excited to start wrapping my presents. Um, but anyway, I'm going to have to go and get some new wrapping paper today too. So that was a really long story <laughs> just to let y'all know that I'm um, waiting to get new paper to start wrapping presents, but I'm hoping that I can stick a few wrapping clips in this video too. Anyway, next step should be going to see if we can get Fisher's big present. I'm excited.
first presents of the year wrapped under the tree hey friends so i feel like i have promised big things on this vlog <laughs> and i have not delivered um so i went the other night it was last night to get that big present for fisher i never said what it was because i thought i was going to be showing you guys in the video but i just couldn't bring myself to do it we were thinking about getting him one of the big electric riding vehicles like you know those battery powered cars which I know he would love and be super excited about but then I was at the store I was looking at them I even had one pulled off the shelf I was looking for a worker to come help me load it up and I just started thinking about how he would probably love it at first for the first couple days and then it would end up like sitting in our yard collecting rainwater, never getting charged back up and never getting used anymore and just be all dirty and wet and gross. I don't know. And so I ended up leaving the store without it and I'm kind of sad about it, but I also feel like it just saved me like a, a few, a couple hundred dollars. Um, and he's going to get enough toys anyway. So I'm such a, like, this is so not in my typical Christmas spirit, but I didn't get it. So I ended up getting him a couple other, um, toys that he had asked for that I hadn't gotten him yet. And I wouldn't have had the money to get him those if I had gotten him that big gift. So I hope that he won't feel bummed on Christmas that he doesn't have like a big gift, but hopefully he'll just be happy with all of the toys that he's getting. Um, he should be, I mean, <laughs> but anyway, I have been shopping like a mad woman and I am so broke <laughs> and I've, um, we, as you saw, we started wrapping some presents today. I'm going to wrap my last few that I have to do right now. Um, my kids wrapped a couple presents that they had picked out for um, some cousins and some friends. And um, I got my husband a couple little things and my mom a couple things to wrap. I haven't started wrapping any of the kids stuff yet, obviously, because I have to film my Christmas videos first. But I'm going to finish up these last couple things I have for other people. And that'll probably do it for this vlog. But hopefully... I'm really hoping to film those videos this coming week and get them posted because obviously people want to use them as help to like to get ideas and, and the closer I wait until Christmas, closer I get to Christmas, the less time they'll be helpful, if that makes sense. So I, I understand that and I am trying to get them done quickly. The, the thing is, I obviously can't do them when any of my kids are around, which makes it very difficult. Um, so that's, that's part of the struggle. But anyway, um, I'm going to get these last presents wrapped and thanks for watching this video. Um, and I will hopefully be seeing you very, very soon with some more Christmas content. <laughs> thanks guys. Bye.